Hey guys, this is Hawkeye and I am back with Call of the Wild and we are here in the Yukon Valley. We're at a different outpost than we were at last time. This place is not so laden with grizzly bears, luckily. Because <laughs> honestly, the weaponry I have, I don't think is going to be very much effective against stopping them. So it could get a little bit too dangerous, to be honest. But we're going to check the map out here. I have put a blind down here on this little lake. And if you look at the big map, this is where I was before. Started out Lumber Shore, then I moved down to this location here. Murphy's Landing, I think it's what it's called. That's where all the grizzly bears are. I basically took the the uh, ATV and just went all the way across over here to Ruslan Ridge. Now this is a big plain area. So the bears are not hanging out here, but the caribou are. So that's what we're going to kind of take a look at, see if we can get us a caribou. Maybe a moose might wander down, I don't know. We will see. I haven't heard any wolves, so I don't think they're here. So this might be as safe as a place as any. <laughs> of course, I am hearing them now. Great. Alright, we're going to go ahead and place a waypoint so that I can find my way there without any issues. Where, where's the way? There it is, okay. I am not getting the ATV out, so... We're just going to walk on down here and hopefully not scare anything off. It's no way to fast travel to the blinds, unfortunately. You gotta, you gotta huff it. Gotta huff it. But I am going to keep an eye out because there may be critters running about. Let's see here. Thought I saw something over there. I hear a lot of wolves. Yeah, the wolves here are not nice. It's not like they are in Hunter Classic. They they'll take you out. Haven't run into them yet, but Delacaba has. Apparently they were chasing after him, a whole pack of them. <laughs> that would be a sight. I have been charged by a grizzly, but he bumped into my ATV and the ATV actually saved my neck. So, that was exciting. Anyway, we're going to wander down here. I do have scent suppression, but I shouldn't need it if I'm up in the tower. I want to save it as much as I can because it's kind of kind of expensive. And you only get 10 shots of it, so... Now, last time I was here, I did see a couple of caribou just wander on down here after a while. So, they are here. Now that is a moose cow. So they are here too. If she'll slow down, I can spot her here. Yep, she's on the move. Okay, looks like there's another hunting tower right over there too. It's n no, actually, that's a that's a uh, lookout tower. Yep, she's just hanging out. I just see the one. I thought I saw something over there. I knew I heard something. Okay, we're just going to have to be very cautious. Something came through here. Let's see. What do we got? Looks a lot like caribou. Yep. There's caribou heading that way.
Well, it's 9 o'clock in the morning. It may be a little late for the caribou to come out and get water. But I think what we'll do is we'll jump up in this blind and we'll just kind of hang out. Damn, they walked right past the blind. Hearing a lot of wolves. Of course, that, that's a sound that can carry quite a distance, so. I'm just gonna take a look see here. Last time I saw some caribou walking right along here. As soon as I can get some more cash, I am going to get some of those antler lures yeah, I'm not seeing anything the only thing I've seen so far is that moose cow alright let's get up in the tower here Okay, let's see here. Those are caribou tracks. And... Looks like they were going that way. Hmm. So there might have been another set. There's that moose. Holy crap. Check it out, guys. <laughs> he just came out of nowhere. I better get my spray out just in case. He's close. Let me see here. Let me get my... Is there another one? Thought I saw some movement. Yep. <laughs> Damn. There's a female. Different female than the one I saw. Now he's got some small antlers though, but Yeah, he they just wandered right on up. Let's see. How far away is he? up here forty six point three eight yards I could hit him with this thing this is the Gonna be a stretch, but I could probably do it. Ooh, just a little bit low. And I spooked him. Damn it. I wasn't wavering around so much. I knew I was pushing my distance on this thing. And there they go. That's all right. You can go too far. I could just get him a little closer. Let's see here. Oh, it's just another moose. Ah, that's there's a caribou. <laughs> Good God. This place is becoming Wild Kingdom here. What the Sorry about the puppy, guys. He isn't bad. He really, he really isn't bad. Alright guys, that moose has not moved any closer. I'm going to try to see how close he really is. 
at the moment. 54. God. I'm going to have to use my rifle to get him. I just don't have the... He's just not close enough. Not unless I can find another one. He's not a bad specimen. That's twice. He's down. Three times. Yeah, these bullets are not the most powerful things in the world. Four times. Man, he is a tough old bird. Yeah, this weapon is not very powerful. I am sorry about the dog. Alright guys, sorry about the altercation we had with the dogs. They were... The puppy wants to play and he, for some reason, is just really riled up right now. But I'm going to head over here and see just what kind of damage I did to this guy. He took off over this hill. He got hit a number of times. I don't know how in the world anything could have taken that many hits. Okay, there's Moose. And there's a blood patch. Alright, finally. Vital organ hit, too. That's good. I need to be careful because that, uh, that boost could charge me. I'm going to go ahead and check this out too. That's where they were drinking. I think that's incoming, yeah. Moose warning call. Okay, that's a trot. That's a trot. Okay, that's where they left. They went out this way. I think this is the one where he was running, right here. That female's not happy. this way. I cannot believe that. Uh oh. Okay. That's a good thing. I like it when they run off. <laughs> Not when they charge. Okay. There's more blood. So 
that a car? Yeah, it is. Big old caribou. I think I better get this out just in case. <laughs> I found him. He's right over here. I'll go ahead and get these tracking. There he is. Take a look at him here, guys. Not bad. I mean, he's not got huge horns, but they're not bad. Let's see, what is he? He's a bronze. So, yeah, I hit him flesh wound here. The second hit was the one that did him in. The others were just flesh wounds. Yeah, this weapon is not all that much for doing damage unfortunately I'm gonna go ahead and accept that I'm gonna need a lot more cash to be able to taxidermy was a caribou here pretty darn close. I wish I knew where he went off to. There's the two moose cows. They are not happy with me. There's the caribou. <laughs> That's called quick reaction there, friends. I knew he was over here. Hit him right in the chest. Could have missed that. Oh, that's the moose. Okay, there's a blood patch. Bleed rate very low. Eh. Must have hit the scapula or something. He's still bleeding, though. Oh, God. Guys, it looks like he is crossing his old path again. That means it's going to be really tricky at this point, unless we find a blood patch of locating the exact one. Let's see if this poop is new or old. It's fresh. Okay, so that's a good sign. I don't know which way it went. He could have gone back up here. See, it looks like he's it's got him going that way. This might be new here. That's coming back. It's very easy to lose these guys because they love to walk back and forth on their own trails. Okay, that's...
Yep, see, it's like right back here. Son of a gun. Is that him? I think that is. Damn it. Yeah, that was him. That was him. Damn it. been slicker and snot about getting away from me. I mean, he had taken a full shot, full shot to the chest. Ugh, I need a much better rifle than this. This thing just not got what it takes. I mean, it took four shots to take a moose down. I mean, unless you get a perfect, perfect shot, they're going to get up and walk. Yeah, guys, I have been tracking this pain in the butt for some time now. And I'm not sure, but I think somehow he's backtracked on me again. Yeah, I think he got up to here, and then he turned around and went back this way. So now it's saying he's going this way. Probably because he heard the wolves. So, let's see here, guys. So he came over there, he went up there, went so far, then he stopped, turned around, came back. Now, I don't think I'm going to find him dead, because he's not bleeding very much. I haven't seen a blood patch in quite some time. This gun just does not do that much damage to these, these animals. And the crossbow, because I'm such a low level, I can't aim with it worth a darn. But we're going to keep tracking him. Maybe we can eventually catch up to him, guys. I don't know. If not, we may have to just let him be. But if you take a look at the map, you'll see. Yep, that's what he's doing. I tracked him all the way along here, guys. Check that out. He went back here, and then he came around here. Now he's headed... He's eventually probably going to head back. That would be my guess. But good lord, I have... No organs hit. So... Must have hit him like right in the scapula or something. But maybe he's going to head over to this waterway. I haven't been over here yet, so honestly it's not a, not a bad thing. I get to discover some new territory. Then that could be good. But I'm also out here with my butt hanging out. <laughs> Well, I'm not really hiding the fact that I'm making noise. I'm hoping that keeps anything really dangerous at bay.
Alright guys, there's something coming up here. I am going to get down here. That may be him. Shoot, he is just out of my sight. Yeah, it's him. Damn it. And I hit him. That time I hit him good. saw him. Can't tell how good of a... Well, he went back this way, so that's... Right along his track. Okay, there's blood. God bless it. Bleed right very low. Let's get pathetic. times. It's like trying to shoot up shooting with a BB gun. <laughs> I swear it's not doing a whole lot of damage to him. Still very low. No organs hit. Non vital. God bless it. Non vital. Which means he's just gonna keep on going. These guys are like Wolverine, they just recover. <laughs> Ah, finally took that bastard down. Didn't think that was ever going to happen. Jeez. But at least I got him. Finally got him. Boy, you were one tough old bird. I will give you that. Yep. Flesh, flesh, pelvis, flesh, intestines. That was the one that finally did him in. Still a bronze. I haven't been doing really all that wonderful with these guys. I did level up, though. So that's something. Okay, I think this is the next lake over here. I feel better knowing that I was able to, to find him. saw something. Yeah guys this is some beautiful territory. Lots of animal life but this 243 just is not cutting it. This is probably a reserve that's made for higher level individuals. Much higher level than I am. Okay, see, that's another place to build a stand, is what that is. Now, I'm not going to do that just yet. I've already done that over by the lake. 
really want to save my money to get some weapons that can do some actual damage. <laughs> But I am going to walk over here and take a look at this lake because this could be a really good spot to keep track of. How close am I to the next? I'm good ways away. That's the next lookout point. Not sure where the next outpost is. That's a lookout point. This is a big map, guys. And if we take our time, we might be able to see some... Maybe even see some bear. I don't want to see bear close. Just at a distance. I'm good. And that's good for me. <laughs> we can't... I've been told that what I'm carrying right now will not take down a bear. Maybe the crossbow will. But he's going to have to be pretty damn close. And I'm not so sure I want to push that. There's the next lake on the map. There's this one here that I'd like, I'd like to check that one out as well. But there's a bunch of these little lakes over here. This is almost a swamp, I think. And there's this lake. And I'm thinking this might be an outpost. So I might have to jump on my old R ATV at some point, ride down here and see if that's what that is. But what we're going to do, we're not going to walk all the way back. We are going to fast travel. We're not, we're not stupid. <laughs> we're going to fast travel back. And we're home. And that was fun. We managed to take down two animals, but it was a... Jeez. It was an effort. It wasn't easy. What is this? That's kind of weird. But yeah, this is... These are those lakes that I was just at. You can kind of see them from over here, and there's a lot that could be going on on these. They're way, way, way over there. Well, anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed that episode. Please be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll be back with another episode of Call of the Wild, The Hunter. And guys, I think this next time we might be heading to Hirschfelden because honestly, like I said, I just don't have the gear for this. As much fun as it is to shoot at him and take down a moose, when it takes that many shots to even phase him, you know, something's up. <laughs> That's a little much. Anyway guys, as I always say, aim straight, cast far, and have fun. And I will see you later. Bye-bye.